we're about to meet with Terry Cruikshank, a longtime window manufacturer. We're going to talk about what makes an energy efficient window, what different types of windows are available, and he's going to give us some tips for window shopping. The windows and the doors are where you're going to penetrate the, the building envelope, so they're weak areas. We live in a, in a pretty unique place, and it's in the Arctic, and uh, we need triple pane low ER zone. We need that up in this area. It's, it's, it's a must. And we need insulating windows that have good U values, good energy efficiency, because uh, we, we can't be comfortable without them. We're gonna yeah. we're gonna kind of keep background noise down for us, Kenny, if we okay. can. Good quality window is gonna need quality components, quality workmanship, and it is it's gonna need quality installation because it's the most vulnerable and weakest point too because of the penetrations made. The two main points for a good window for energy efficiency is is, is gonna be the window itself, the glass. Or are we using the best glass option we can? Low E glass, two sheets, triple pane, argon, maybe krypton. So that's going to keep us from having heat loss out that window. And then the window's not worth a darn if it doesn't have good weather stripping because you need insulating value and you need air tightness. NFR C label is very important for the, the purchaser of a window to know what am I buying? How much energy efficiency am I going to get? Just like a car, we were talking about how much gas mileage per gallon will I get out of a car? Well, it's, it's on the sticker, it's going to tell you. The lower the U value, the better. It's the U valley, value is telling us how much resistance to heat loss we have from the inside of the house going out. The only adhesive is that tape, huh? Mm -hmm. Yeah, but it's really, really t uh, firm. It, it grabs a hold of it and it, it flat holds it there. We're going to need at least dual weather strips. It has to be continuous, go all the way around the frame. No gaps, no breaks, no miters. You also need in a vinyl window the multiple chambers in your frame that give you your insulating value. So the important thing is to make sure that you're getting a good product. The quality, the workmanship, all of these things really, really matter.